Pill Magazine with Jasmine Glaser. How are you? Not bad. Just finished a hot and fast crit here in Sacramento. Mm -hmm. Did you avoid the crashes? I did, and I think I was probably in the like 15% of riders that didn't have to detour through the pit today. So. <laughs> Were you attacking today? Um, I was following some moves off the start. Uh, Specialized Lululemon went out really fast with Evie going off of the line, so kind of covered that one. And then you know, just some of the the crashes, I wasn't feeling super confident anymore after a few of those. Mm -hmm. So uh, not maybe my type of race, but hopefully saved a little bit for the time trial tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a big one tomorrow uh, for you, especially um, being that you're a predominantly track. Uh, how does this race? compare contrast. <laughs> you know, I, one of my favorite races is the point series and you'd think this would be somehow, you know, transfer over pretty good, but uh, I don't know. I think maybe it's just that everyone has brakes. I'm not used to that from the track. <laughs> no, I mean, it's, you know, I definitely feel comfortable with the speed and with the aggressiveness of the races, um, but it is different, you know, just with the road conditions and uh, just the, the different levels of riders in here as well. That, that was definitely a factor today. Mm -hmm. So, uh, bringing it into tomorrow, what is your, you know, time trials, this is great, of course now there's going to be quite a few more riders than normal, competitions higher, how does that feel for you? Yeah, I mean, anytime you get to race against the top of the world, I mean, Evelyn Stevens, Carmen Small, Allison Powers, um, those are the, some of the world's top time trial riders, so it's going to be great to have a bench line of how I compare against those riders, I mean, you know, down the road, the time trial is one of my big goals, um, so, like I said, this is a great opportunity for me to see kind of, you know, how far off the mark I am. Well, in Georgia, just last week, uh, was about eight, nine days ago, you beat them most. Um, yeah, I had an okay ride. I think I finished ninth, um, which I was probably hoping for a little bit better, but, you know, maybe just didn't have the legs on the day, and it was uh, at altitude as well. Uh, so some different conditions there, but tomorrow is a completely different type of course. Um, I think it'll be a fast course, and, you know, one that suits really powerful riders. Um, but, you know, like I said, some, some of the world's best time trial is here, so it's going to be a really deep field. Mm -hmm. uh, your experience in California, you're a team Tibco, so you're California based. Um, and you have a Canadian uh, manager, of course, Linda Jackson. Uh, it must be really fun for you, especially having that support as well. Yeah, having that uh, Canadian connection on the team is always great. Last year I was the only Canadian on the team, um, bar Linda, of course, was the team uh, owner. Um, so this year I have two Canadian teammates, and um, so that's nice on its own, and it'll be especially nice going into the Canadian National Championships, having a little bit of a team there, um, a little bit more of a presence, so that's going to be a big help. Mm -hmm. Great, congratulations on today, and uh, I don't see any, any marks on you, which is good. Yeah. Everyone did pretty well. We'll look forward to seeing your results tomorrow, and hope you do well. Thank you.